Oh, so you want to, you, you want to... No, it's in front of the point. Doesn't matter. Well, I've made the point, you know, so... so. Okay, so, are uh, the books, as in, from the, say, Greek, Russian, Syrian Orthodox Church, are they valid priests in, uh, in the Catholic view? Yes. In the Catholic view, they are valid priests, yes. Okay. So, they, so all their sacraments are valid in the Eastern Orthodox Church. It's just that we'd say, well, they, they are schismatic yeah. and separated from... It's like... Um, so they're valid but irregular? I'd put it... That's one way of putting okay. it, yeah. Because you can get... There are... You know the um, Tuck line of bishops? The Vietnamese... I think it was a Vietnamese bishop. Yeah. And he started ordaining... Yes. ...loads and loads of blokes as bishops. Yeah. Now, they are bishops. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but he's in schism. Yes. And so they, they're not... They're illicit. Because um, we were talking about this other day in some in discourse, and he said, How can you say that the SSPX are not valid priests, but you can with, with the Orthodox? I said, No, 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 that's not true. They are, the, the SSPX are valid priests. They just in the same position as the Orthodox. They, they are valid priests, but irregular. They have done something. They're in a position which is not 100% aligned in the church. But the Orthodox are valid priests, same as the SFPX. Yes. And he said, no, no, that's not true. The SFPX are not valid priests. They are valid priests. Yeah. They're just not in yeah. line. They're not, they're known as irregular. I think it may be a natural confusion that people have. If it's valid, why isn't it just fine? If you're saying there's something wrong with it, how can you say it's valid? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's that, that idea that you have, you, you are a real priest, but yeah. you know, we could have a priest in our parish. He suddenly decides to go off, get drunk, gamble, then set up with a woman and tell his bishop to go and sling his hook. Yeah, yeah. Well, he's still a priest, yeah. you know, as, as it says um, in, I think in Hebrews, thou art a priest forever yes. in the order of Melchizedek. So you don't lose your priesthood no. just because you go off and go be crazy and you disobey your bishop. Yes. Um, but you're still a priest. So that's what some folks might find it hard to understand. And I, I get it. But yeah, these guys in the SSPX then are valid priests. So you receive a sacrament from them. It is a real sacrament. Yes. No doubt about that. But you should. I'm going to take a one down. Don't go yet. Okay. Oh, right. My Sorry. comment is referring to yes. what you want. Um, that, that priest who is a fallen one, as yes. you mentioned, he's still got the, um, uh, he's got, he's got the powers all the time, but he's got also permission yes. to give the absolution in extreme necessity, that is at the point of death. Yes. Yes. And it is valid and you can call that priest when someone is dying. Yes, that's, that's yes. Just no, that, that's good to know, that's good yeah. to say yeah. actually. Yeah. Canon law uh, yeah. provides for it. Yeah, uh, yeah. Um, because I did once take communion, but I asked my priest first. I, I used to go to Our Lady of Victories in High Street, Kensington, and I befriended the local Coptic priest. He used to come to McDonald's, and he once said, come to Mass, come to Mass, come on, I know you. And I asked uh, my parish priest, can I take communion in the local Coptic? And he said, you've met Father Mikhail, haven't you? I went, yes. He goes, you know what? Don't take it. I said, but it's not a state of emergency. It depends how you look at it. He goes, yes, it's valid. Don't worry. He said, the cop takes a valid priest and it's a valid sacrament. So don't worry. So. Yeah. But I did ask, because I take it in the Anglican church. Okay. Okay. Um, because they don't have a valid priesthood. Yeah, that's right. So, and Pope Leo the Thirteenth. Um, is it Satis Cognitum, something like that? I forget the name of the encyclical in the 1890s. Um, yeah, 1895, they're about... No, they're not at all, that's right. Um, so they haven't passed on. Yeah. They haven't got the authority to pass on yeah. the, um, the sacramental power yeah. uh, of the priesthood. And so you don't receive valid Holy Communion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just be receiving bread. That was they lost it mm. not during the reign of Henry VIII yet, but later, Elizabeth of time, because they, I think they changed something Chains. with the formula. I, yes, yeah. they did. They did. That's right. So that's how new priests simply weren't real priests. Oh.
So as the as the old priest died off, that was the end of real church. Yeah.